at 10. It is May 5th, Cinco de Mayo, a day of celebration in the Southwest and around the country. But do people really know what they're celebrating? Let's get to News 4 News on Sean Mooney for a tutorial on this misunderstood holiday. Hey, Sean. Well, Chris, we've got music, we've got libations with lots of people, a pretty good turnout here at Cervezas at the Tucson Mall. But I'll tell you what, you know, with Cinco de Mayo, are they here for this event? Uh, an excuse to have muchas margaritas? Or is it truly this annual event, a remarkable day that is marked in the history of Mexico? Actually, it's a little of both. So what are we celebrating? Cinco de Mayo. And what does that mean? I don't know. It's the battle of um, what she said. The Cinco de Mayo, it was the, oh my God, the battle with Mexico and French. So it might be a good excuse to meet up with friends and party. But why Cinco de Mayo? In Mexico, it's not a national holiday. Celestino Fernandez was born in Mexico and has taught sociology at the U of A for 39 years. He says Cinco de Mayo actually represents a David and Goliath battle with the French more than 150 years ago. Well, it took place May 5th, 1862. And the French uh, were in the process of occupying Mexico. And the French forces, about 6,000 of them. And the Mexicans got together, roughly a couple thousand of them. And the significance of the date is that the Mexican army won that battle. Fernandez says in Mexico, the only place where Cinco de Mayo is a big deal is in Puebla, where the battle took place. But in America, it's just another day for businesses to cash in. In Mexico, it doesn't have the significance that it's been given here, but primarily uh, through marketing. And it's another way, another day to sell us stuff. Now, while uh, Cinco de Mayo may indeed be another manufactured American holiday, law enforcement takes it very seriously. As a matter of fact, throughout the city of Tucson, there are DUI task force all over tonight looking for impaired drivers. Reporting live from central Tucson, Sean Mooney, News 4 Tucson.